So we've been working on uh, songwriting as a worship team and basically talking about writing songs that are from our church and for our church. So as part of that plan to kind of start to write music from our church for our church, uh, the most recent song that we've been working on is called I Pray. Uh, it's a song that we did this summer and then also at Refresh Worship Night and Prayer Night this summer. So I Pray came out of, we knew that we were stepping into a season as a church going into the summer where we were going to be focusing on and digging deep into prayer. And so we have a, a church focus and we also have a worship focus. And so we decided that for this summer, our worship focus was going to be uh, dig deep roots, pray bold prayers. So as a worship team, we were like, man, wouldn't it be great if we had a song that expressed the heart of the Lord's prayer that our church could worship with congregationally, but also that they could worship with on their own and be like, okay, I have five minutes and I wanna pray and I don't really know what to say. Here's, what, here's something that I can listen to and I can just pray along with it. So the heart of the song is the Lord's Prayer, but the chorus of the song is these empty hands are lifted high, uh, be lifted high in my, in my life. Um, my heart is yours, come have your way, these, th these things I pray. And so one of the things that Pastor Bob actually articulated really well the first time that we did this song was what does it mean to lift empty hands? Um, and so when you lift empty hands, it means that you are both giving up the things that you have been holding onto and also that you are receiving the things that you need. Um, and so we took the heart of the Lord's prayer being your kingdom come, your will be done as are on earth as it is in heaven to say the, the whole heart of this song is my heart belongs to you, God, um, come have your way with me. And what we ended up settling on was this tagline of, I pray, let your kingdom come, start here in this room and let me look like you. And so much of how we think about the kingdom of God coming is often that we think about the kingdom of God coming outside and then influencing us. And so we wanted this prayer to be like, God, let your kingdom come and start with me. 